cutting-edge research and groundbreaking technologies might never provide successful products or services if they're hidden away in a lab or just published as a thesis. I'm surrounded by great ideas that never came out of paper. Cohitech provides researchers with a hands-on experience in technology transfer and commercialization. It's not enough to have a great idea, it's really important to understand if there's a market for it uh, and that's what we are doing here. This is an opportunity to actually try to translate our science into products that can actually change or can have an impact into people's lives. Due to the large number of applicants, projects must undergo a comprehensive selection process in order to take part in the program. Every year, uh, Pedro Villarino goes through a process of uh, searching for technologies and then we go through a very careful process of deciding which ones go into the program. When we do the technology selection, we want to make sure that the people who are involved have a chance to be successful. During its 18 weeks, Cohitech joins researchers, MBA students and mentors, thus empowering each project with a more skillful and balanced team. It also supplies the means to develop a convincing business plan and an engaging presentation of the product or service they intend to commercialize. It's easier for a scientist to learn the business opportunities than for an experienced business person to go back and learn about nanoscience and nanotechnology at the appropriate level. And what we're needing is all the learning and the business mentality in order to identify and pursue good business opportunities. By combining the classroom sessions, the seminars and work groups with its specific method, Cohitech offers a wide and unique schedule that mimics real-world challenges and deadlines. Our researchers go to the markets and they try to figure out what is their business model through contacts they make directly with the market. Building a text, building some information that you want to capture his attention and you don't want to show them what you have, or at least don't show everything, it's really difficult. Every week they should try and excel doing whatever it's asked in the deliverables. This is really opening a lot of different ideas and definitely we are learning a lot. It will be very useful because it gives us great tools. Cohitech opens up a whole new world of possibilities, one that researchers are often unaware of. Sometimes not even the technologists themselves understand what their technologies can do in the marketplace. When we came here, we came with an idea. We fine-tuned this idea several times. We have been uh, uh, mutating uh, even our product. The idea doesn't always evolve as we wish. We sometimes have to change the direction to find the best way. Part of it is a journey, a learning journey for the scientists. They, they're going through a process of thinking primarily about their science to a process of thinking about their science in a broader context of society and business and value and so on. A midterm session was held at ISCTE, IUL, so that teams could test their presentations in a more public environment. I know how to do a good presentation, but I'm not used to doing it with this kind of information that we have here. The question and answer and expert feedback that followed provided each team with valuable data that can lead to substantial changes in the pitch and the overall project strategy. It's great to have input from people from different industries with more experience who can really help you shift and adapt your ideas and make you look at problems in a way that you probably haven't thought about before. Our major difficulties was that we were spread all over. We were trying to find applications, we were trying to find specific solutions instead of working directly on our technology and applying it. I don't really feel there are difficulties, I feel there are challenges. But the challenges, they usually are constructive. If we can face the challenge and solve it, that won't be really a difficulty, it will be an improvement for us. One of those challenges is the public presentation that the teams will perform at the closing session. Now it's the time for them to really 
get down to the fine details of okay we have an opportunity how big it is okay it's big how we make it real Porto Business School was the host for the 2014 closing session and the appropriate stage for the teams to play out their pitches. In a short period of time, the presenters of each team must convince the audience that they've got the best solution for a specific market need, the real deal. We have a new technology. Very important features. This drug is really effective. Better clinical decision. We can save thousands of lives. We'll be feeding the world. This could be revolutionary. Thank you. And they know that questions that arise from the audience must have a proper answer. Okay, one more question down here. You have to sign a lot of documents to get the answer. Okay. A keynote speech and a debate ensued the presentation. After leaving the stage, there's still work to be done. Networking is essential, and this event provided an excellent environment for the exchange of contacts and ideas. A real-life experience in the business world, closing the 2014 co high -Tech edition on a high note. The most amazing part for me as a teacher is to see their evolution in 18 weeks. They transform themselves in, into different persons. Now, before starting doing something in the lab, we double check if it wasn't done or if there's a patent already out with something similar. To have some plan while in the laboratory to, to build something, build a research hypothesis that in the end leads to a commercializable product. Of the 15 teams that completed the course, some might get more traction from Cotex other initiatives. Researchers in the lab, combined with business students and the tech algorithm, what we've been teaching, doing a, a basic validation of the idea, testing it against the market, putting together a business plan that makes sense, and then moving on and going to something exactly like ACT. Designed for proof of concept, business development and investment purposes, ACT targets effective actions to help companies flourish and achieve a global scale. And so when you get some technologists that also know the practical implications of what their inventions have been, it's a very powerful combination. Co-High Tech, turning science into business.